unstoppable. This is a hair-raising true life story of the runaway train. It's like a it's a bomb travelling at 70 miles an hour. That's it. F from beginning to end, this is kind of sitting on the edge of your seat time. That's what everybody keeps saying, you know. I, 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 I well, Tony did a great job. And, you know, I, when I saw the film, I was sitting on the edge of my seat and I knew what was going to happen. So uh, I knew we had something really good that people would enjoy. I'll tell you what I liked. 90 minutes, uh, nice personal drama, lots of action, and you don't have to wear special glasses to enjoy it. <laughs> ah, imagine that. It is, it's a, it is a time when you can actually tell a story and you don't need to do the 3D thing. That's kind of right. nice, isn't it? And not a lot of uh, 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 green screen and CGI mm -hmm. work. I mean, real stunts, you know, we're really... You were, uh, you were hanging off that train then? Hanging off the train, running on top of the train, you know. Yeah, I, I like the fact that you're still prepared to do that stuff. Yeah, I didn't like it when they, when they asked me to. I was like, it's just it's stupid. You are but, crazy. Yeah. yeah. But, you know, that, you, you, you're back working with Tony Scott, as you say. Um, you, this is the fifth time together. Mm -hmm. Do you kind of, uh, do you have a telepathy now after all of these great pictures you've I worked think so. together? I think we have a shorthand. I think that uh, he knows how I like to work. I know mm -hmm. how, you know, what he's doing and... You know, we don't get in each other's way, and, and you know, I like Tony. He's, he's easy to work for. He's a hard worker. You can't get to work before he gets there, and you won't leave before, you know, after him, so. Yeah. Is he, is he, is he making the days shorter as, as the years go by, or is he still working you hard? No, he works you hard. Okay. He works you hard. And you play Frank Barnes, who's, who is the old-timer to Chris Pine's Will Coulson. Are you, uh, are you now quite comfortable in getting the getting to these kind of old timer old roles. Old timer roles? <laughs> no. I'm not don't put, don't put me in don't, a wheelchair. You yet. don't look it in no, real life. It's acting. Yeah. It's acting. Uh, but, but the good thing is there's there's plenty of great parts for you know old for the, guys? For the older, older old guys. Yeah, you 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 have got, got many years to go before you get <laughs> into the Morgan Freeman role, haven't you really? Ouch. And I, I looked I looked again at uh, Training Day last night. Uh, such a great film, still stands the test of time and uh, kind of, you know, you playing not a very nice guy. Do you mm. do you do you miss those kind of roles? Um, no. <laughs> well, the, f the film I'm doing next year, I'm not so nice. I don't know if I'm as bad as in Training Day, but I'm pretty, you know. Yeah. Oh, what's that called? I won't, I won't talk about it. Oh, okay, you know, it's all right. Is it one of yours? Directing yeah. you? No. Okay. Um, um, and congratulations on the Tony, too. So back in the theater uh, in 2010 and a big success. Yeah, I've been blessed. You know, Oscar and a Tony, that's, that's pretty good. But, Two Oscars. In but, but gratifying, I suppose, because you started in theater. So uh, nice to go back and still prove that no, you can do it. It's still my first love. Is it really? Yes, it is. And, and, and you know, it's hard work and being there every night. And, but I, I really, really had a good time. I look forward to going back. I suppose being there every night is at least shorter days than days on set, which are very long days. Yeah, but action packed once you get there, you yeah. know. But you, I, I loved it. And what is it that's what is it you love about? Is it the instant relationship with the audience? Is it is it the danger of the immediacy of the crowd there? It's that, and it's 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 theater is an actor's medium. Mm. Film is a director's medium. You know, we can we can shoot a scene with the two of us talking. But the director could be zooming in on a poster or, or microphone or something. And but once that curtain goes up, it, it's all about the actors. So mm. the, the, there's the challenge. That's yeah. the challenge. No, there's no cut. As I get older, I less like traveling. Uh, what about you? Do you still like? Do you still like travel? It's a, I guess it's an essential part of the job. Oh well, yeah, it's mm. part of the part of the gig. No, I like traveling. I yeah. want vacations and stuff. You don't yeah. like? Well, you, I less like flying. I was going to ask you the next question is, you know, what about the next time you're thinking about getting a train journey? Will you? Have you a know, I really, thought? I actually do want to. I've never done it. I've always wanted to go across country on a train. Yeah. You know, and really, I mean, I've flown over the United States a million times, but I've never been down there. It's a really nice. Am Amtrak is a great experience. I did uh, Boston to New York, which is yeah. of course long. Oh, yeah, I've done that. That's a great. You know, that you see a different America by right. by making take, taking those train journeys. Right. Yeah. So, what's next after Unstoppable? What do we see you in next? Uh, well, you won't see me for a good year and a half, two years. Is it something we've said? Is it something we've said? <laughs> no, no, no. Just uh, I won't have a film out. Yeah. Another film out until uh, 2012, I guess. Well, this is a great big Christmas hit, so uh, you're very welcome back, Thank and you. thanks for your time. Thank you. Many thanks. I appreciate it.